everyone welcome back welcome back to my channel i am sandeep sandeep ranjan and today we are going to see few things about extrude tool in fusion 360 so for exploring more in extrude let's make some design let's sketch something on this plane so we will start with design sketch and we will just go on the top view and on top view we will be making one rectangle okay so i will just select rectangle from the center so it will go in a proper dimensions whichever is required to us we will make a small rectangle now just go to the like finish sketch and after that we will be having option called extrude and now we'll increase it let's go with like 50 mm let me bring it to the center so that you can see it more clearly okay so now i have done here extrude option now in this particular section you can see variety of options are available like profiles start direction extent type distance taper angle and then operations what operations actually we are looking for so let's see what actually happens when we change the degree of taper angle so there will be some by default like minus 20 degree so if we go with minus 20 degree it will make like one pyramid type structure here also we are having certain circles so let's rotate it a little bit and now we will just rotate it from here instead of giving some dimension to that particular place so here we can see now this structure is completely looking like pyramid type structure from all the four sides and we have created this only with the help of one rectangle and what we have used we have used only taper angle over here so from the taper angle we can make certain changes we can increase we can decrease the size it depends upon like our users what actually we are looking for okay so i hope uh, this taper angle is clear to you now now after this we are having here direction one side two side let's see what is there with two side so two side will give you certain option where you can extrude the image from both the side now here also you can see one arrow button just select and start dragging it so now here we can see here side one and side two now let's see like what all changes we can do in the bottom section so here also we are having taper angle so once we will just come back to this section then here we can see taper angle right now it is zero degree what if we change it from here then it also start giving the shape accordingly okay what if we increase it so it gives the shape according to that all right then again we will increase the length like let's say now this much is fine so with the help of this taper angle you can create now like a diamond type structure let's go with okay and now we'll go to home now you can see here if you make it in a more finer way then somewhere it will look like pyramid or diamond type of structure which you can create okay so this was all about extrude and taper angle i hope this is clear to you so just go through this video learn accordingly and if you have any doubts or any questions then definitely you can put in the comment section thank you so much have a good day stay home stay safe